So hello everybody, welcome to the final of the Friday Night Nine Ball Tournament hosted by NineBall.com and enjoyed by many, many players. This tournament is a staple of the VP community, Virtual Pool. And over the, over the years, uh, many, many players, myself, I've won it many times and you know, hundreds and hundreds of tournaments, literally it's been played every week for over 10 years. There's not many internet tournaments can say that. And as you can see, the wonky rack pointing a little bit to the right. Not sure how you take advantage of that, but we have the finalists. We'll introduce them. We have Sorgi and we have Wolfpack, who won in the last video. If you watch the losers final, you can watch that match against Stubb, known as Real Poland Power Number One now on VP. We're a former world champion, a fantastic player. And Wolfpack here has, has a four deficit start. Um, as player one has a low rating, Virtual Pool Online um, gives him a, a handicap, which makes him a little bit fairer. The premise being that Wolfpack's a better player, so he gets a start, and he has a harder task to um, basically has to win 9 3 in order for Sogi not to be the champion this week. The, both won some virtual dollars. The winner gets 730, which is, I think, worth about $7 maybe. And the runner-up gets about four dollars, uh, three dollars sixty-five roughly, um, which is three hundred and sixty-five virtual dollars or VP dollars. Sometimes the handicaps uh, don't quite reflect playing ability, and I think if Sogi's a good player, that would be consistent. Um, we'll have to see how he plays to see if he warrants that. Sometimes these games are damp squibs because. The handicaps simply aren't realistic, and that was a foul. Yep, foul, low ball, not hit first. So we'd expect Wolfpack, if he's going to win this, he's going to have to mop up as many games as possible. We have six players in the lobby at the moment. Gratis, Z Karaokea, who I've played doubles with a number of times and always have fun with him. He's a good player. Vigeran, Gratis, we have myself, and the two players. So we might have a few more joining in. There's usually about... Uh, Six or seven players will watch a match. Um, if I had to guess how I think it's going to go, I think Wolfpack will be tough to beat. Um, so you'll have to take his chances. So this is fairly straightforward, Wolfpack. He's played all night. It's a long tournament. Started about three hours ago. Um, and is always a well-populated tournament. It's double elimination. Obviously handicapped and... Uh, what Wolfpack will be wanting most of all is an open shot on the low ball, getting a ball on the break. Um, Iron Maiden's asking for a private message session. Um, I'm just going to accept that and say I am recording, so can't chat. I'll just leave that on there because you guys won't be able to see what I'm saying. Um, but he's saying K, uh, shout out, shout out Iron Maiden. And uh, the same Wolfpack seems to have improved in the chat there. I think I think it's fair to say that he has. I mean, it, I think it's unfair to say that he's dramatically better only simply because he was really good to start with. I remember playing him when he first came on board, started to play, and he was he was a top player. So right from the start, he was a tough a tough ask. Um. Is prone to the odd pressure miss, but you know, he knows where the pockets are. So, what would you do here, guys? Would you play the safety or would you go all out for the win? Just for the benefit of changing the, the, the view, I've put it to a blue cloth, the default screen. I just wanted to change it up from the last video a little bit. So, I think, if I'm not, oh, well, I think he's left that one bad. Can't tell whether he went for that one or not, really. But it's given Sogi a chance to... Who's, who's a new player? Um, it'd be great for him to win the first tournament. Real Paul and Powers entered the room, so he will be a keen spectator. He might have fancied beating Wolfpack in the last game. Didn't really get a chance. Uh, Wolfpack started off very well. Missed a nine ball to go 3-0 up, and Real Paul and Power hadn't even had a shot. And then stubbed through it away 
2-1 uh, went in off and that was pretty much game over at that point but Sogi as a new player gets a four start so a great chance for him to get a tournament win on the board can be frustrating to play against when you play somebody who can actually run the balls and has like a very low rating but if you look at it um, and uh, Stubbs being a bit unfortunate in the chat um, but if you look at the ratings, it's 1915 to 2153. So that's only 238 points behind. Um, so you do kind of find yourself wondering how that's got the four games start. And he's missed a bad one there. I wonder if that was anything to do with still being a bit rude in the chat. He might get himself banned for that one. Um, so Wolfpack... Has to be careful with this plant because the white will naturally go away from the five, and the five will naturally stick. So he's gonna. What he should be doing here is playing it with a bit of side spin to avoid that from happening. But providing he's happy with the cut, all is well. But he's just put himself under a little bit of pressure here, and he can't afford to ship many games. Yeah, that was that was always the danger. He can't afford to ship many games to Sogi with silly errors like that. He should have thought that one out a bit better. I think he can, I'm not sure if he can whack this one in with a lot of power and go in off a couple of jaws. Either that he can just do what I would do and just pay with a little bit of side off the edge of the pocket and just freeze the five. Sort of like a double kiss really. We'll see what he's got to do. He has got an extension in hand if he wants it. But he decides to keep it and he's done pretty much what I would have done there. I would have tried to leave the white a bit further down table just to avoid any crazy cut but this is actually not easy for Wolfpack to work out what to do here this is a danger because you're going to hit that nine and he's done that very very well he might even have set himself up with a plant but does he dare go for it because well, he's going to probably have to here because the shot in the corner now you cannot really play it so full blooded for four two No, that wasn't very good. But he's done the right thing in getting the seven safe. Um, it wasn't easy, don't get me wrong. And that's not a bad safety. Um, he might want. He might try and cut this in. There was also the double. I think you've got to attack in situations like this. Well, he played the safety and hats off to him for that because he has played a good one. And we have an interesting little standoff now. What's Sogi going to do? Is he going to go for it? If you're looking at the angles, if you're good at working them out, you might see what I see, where if you cut this in, you might just pot that nine in the middle. I don't know whether you're good. It's crazy to go for it, mind. Absolutely silly. And he uses his extension up. And this is where Wolfpack's got to play the long game. Keep tying him up in difficult situations and he won't have an extension to do with it. And he has made what I would say is a, is a mini error. He's... um. Banking on Wolfpack not getting up for the nine. And we've seen that he's a very capable potter. And if you remember against Stubb, he played a very similar shot. And that's exactly what, well... Hmm, I don't know what I would do here. I might even come off with left-hand side right off the left edge here and come round behind the nine. Um, but the only problem is then you, you can't afford to open that eight up. So he might play safe here. I have a feeling he will just nick off the left-hand side and come round. Yep, that's a good shot, and that's exactly what I would have tried to do. And to be fair, the Wolfpack, he's done it extremely well. Great shot. So Sogi is now in all sorts of bother. He 
he's got to come off this top cushion he has no extension remember and he's got to try and get this eight safe or fluke it in of course that's a good good looking shot but I think he's left it on yep he's lamied it up so Wolfpack's got what he wanted an open chance he's got to mop these two up um, not sure what he's doing here with his cube flapping all over the place but a nice stun run through and an easy nine ball and this tournament is sponsored by Tiger Q's and that will vanish as soon as the break shot has come to rest. 4-2 to Sorgi in the final to race to nine. Seventh rack coming in. Now, as this uh, sponsor logo goes away, you'll see what a lovely table it is for Wolfpack. And he's more than capable of getting these. And to be fair, you'll keep hearing me say it. Well, that's not good. That's inaccurate, and he's got a problem here that he's going to nick off the seven, and he's going to go in off. If he's not careful, he's going to have to not play playing ball. Well, I'm worried about this one. Yep, yeah, if that if he'd have potted that clean, that would have gone in off the seven, in off the five. Sorry. So if Sorgi hits this with a lot of top, like a lot of top right hand side, he'll open this three up. But he's got to really whack it and really hit it thin with a lot of right hand side. But he's playing a careful game. There's nothing wrong with that, by the way. I'm a reckless clown of a player sometimes. Now, the problem for, for Sorgi, and I hope I'm saying his name right. If I saw G, I apologise. Uh, he's going to have to be careful not to get into a situation where he's not clearing up, where he's hitting a couple of balls, playing safe. It's too safe. You've got to get to nine. You can't afford to play tippy-tappy with Wolfpack. You've got to beat him. Because he's a, a good player, and he, you know, if you start to try and. It's a classic error of not so good players against your opponent when you're the second player to so try to contain them. You can't do it because they will outpot you eventually. So it looks like Wolfpack's playing pretty solidly. Nothing to suggest that. My prediction that he's going to win was wrong, but Poole can change pretty quick. Can he jump at this one? He doesn't. He's actually gone for the nine. Did he go for the nine there? I think he did. Was it maybe a bit reckless because he wasn't thinking about leaving the white safe unless he was trying to hit the nine and keep it down there? Because Wolfpack should be able to pot this seven. And then he's up and running. That's a lovely shot. Doesn't want to go behind the eight. There, he's fine. So, Wolfie. Uh, again, he's he's just not quite doing it right at the minute. Looks like a small mistake, but you know what angle not to leave when you're a good player so this one's harder than it should have been and there you go an uncharacteristic miss but that wasn't the problem it was the last shot he played it was the shot well it was the three ball that, that was the error the miss was just the consequence of that So forgive me yawning guys I've had a hell of a long day and uh, work's been busy and I'm ready for bed but I'm going to catch this final I'm going to get it uploaded I'm going to get both of them uploaded before I go to bed I'm staying up for the duration because I don't have to be up really early tomorrow so I'm going to take one for the team and get that video up so Sorgi with a great chance here Ooh, poor miss on the six. You see, he's got away with it, but the fact that he's missing these balls, you know, would you expect um, Wolfpack to win three out of the next four racks? 
at this rate, yes, I would. And that would mean it would be 5-5 five, five, and then a race to nine. Can Sorgi come back at that point after he's lost five out of the first six racks and win? So really important that Sorgi gets a rack or two on the board. Keep ahead of Wolfpack. And at the moment, it's looking unlikely. So he probably needs to have a go at this. Try and double it in the bottom corner and get on the eight. Just force the issue a little bit. A good effort. Now, is that going to go right to the top? It's the classic v virtual pool treble. And that's what I said. Just He has to force the issue a little bit. He can't afford to just sit back and play safe. So I commend him on that shot. Dizzy's arrived now. We've got 11 people in. Is that going to go in, though? You see, you cannot afford to miss those. You just can't. Wolfpack's too good. That shows he's a bit nervous to me. Probably his first final. He knows it's a big tournament. He's keen to win. And Wolfpack knocks a lovely ball in. And it's going to be 4-3 now. And it should have been 5-2. And that's a big difference. So Wolfpack's got the break. And he's almost got rid of the handicap. Seven ball goes down. He's looking for a shot on the one ball. Two ball goes down, and there's a shot on an open one. And as this sponsor logo goes away, look at that run out. Really here, you should just pick up the pace and just knock these in. That's what I would do. Just try and get rid of them as quick as possible. Don't overthink it. Just get down, knock them in, and clear up. In fact, the only thing he has to do here is probably stop shot on the five. This is a bit of a roadmap. Stop shot on the five, roll the, f roll the six in. You're guaranteed to be on the eight. If anything, I wouldn't even have left that angle. I would have just... He's going to have to be careful. He might want to go behind this. We'll see what he chooses. That's okay. You can just top spin this. Just aim for the cushion on the top white spot on the left. And everything's fine. The worst thing that can happen is a ridiculous miss. But personally, I don't think he's going to do it. Just a little bit of bottom on this eight ball. Don't hit it too hard. Don't over undercut it. And that's a lovely run out by Wolfpack at the perfect time. And uh, can't really can't, can't really say he did anything wrong there. So he's got rid of the handicap now, and it's a race to five for the for the title. So who do you fancy? Alternate breaks. Um, I think you've got to favour Wolfpack now. Very much so. So he's had a couple of chances. He hasn't took them. I'm not sure about that break shot. Um, there is a, a combination shot from the four to the nine. You'd have to be where the red is or just a little bit out. But it is on. Um, it's a few shots away though. Well, that's a strange one there. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have gone near that carom. It's always a temp temptation to do that, to sort of hedge yourself. But it was so far in the pocket, it was dangerous. Now, the shot I would play here is just a, a full ball roll at the six. It will go in. Screw back off the two and the combo on the four to the nine. Now, I don't know what on earth that was. That was a strange way he did it, but it's all right. Now, here he's just got to come off thin and get the white over to the side cushion. Dead easy, just roll it in, not even any pace. Just dead dead speed. And then pot the combo. Needs to get a bit further over. Well, has he got it? He probably has got it. If he just nicks the four ball, I think he'll be fine here. He could snooker him, but I think go for the nine. Well, will he get it right? It's got a probably worth taking his extension here. Should be a combo. And he, he got it. So well played to Sorgi. So that's two racks in a row. Where it's gone with the, the break. Without the other guy getting a shot. Um, sorry no. Wolf did get a shot. But made a mess of it. And. Uh, 
And nine's close to going in the middle, but didn't quite. So Wolfpack surrenders the table. So we get to back. Wolfpack will just be feeling like that was a bit unlucky. Can only blame himself though, because he did go in off. But I still think it's in his hands because Sogi's missing balls he shouldn't be missing. Don't think that was what he planned. Um, but how do you get out? The fact that that seven's gone safe next to green does change things a little bit, but so he doesn't need to be thinking about that just yet. It's not a difficult run out, he just needs to pot a few balls really. Well, that hasn't worked. I, mean, I think it's clear that Sogi's a, a decent player because he, he's making sort of the right shot. He's making it difficult, but I think he's not quite appreciating the virtual pool four abilities of some of the best players. Like, for example, there, I would back Wolfpack to get close to that quite a lot. Um, we have got 11 players in the, in the lobby now watching this final. We're in kind of the middle of the match. It's, you know, could be another sort of next four racks will be really critical as to how this match is going to go uh, that was a that wasn't the best shot he's ever played now Wolfpack doesn't want to get bogged down in in the kind of scrappiness of, of what Sorgi's doing he's got to just keep running out um, so I wouldn't play safe here I would just get cleared I think he will because he's an attacking player You see, to me, he just got bogged down there, and there was no need for that. He should have just potted the ball with a little bit of bottom left. He'd have come back to where pretty much where the two is, and he could have got on with clearing up. You know, you you can't play safe to a title. You've got to earn it. And don't forget, as pool players, we're all far better at potting the balls than we are at. Um, Playing safe. I don't know, it seems he has to jump this one, so he might not quite be able to see it. Well, maybe Wolfpack just got the snooker. So the pace of the game has slowed down. That's usually an indication that Wolfpack's really trying because he, he does tend to slow down. Personally, I like to see the games flow. I'm sure all of you guys are the same. Um, the slower I go, the more I miss, <laughs> which is uh, some strange characteristics. That was a good shot, an attacking shot. Oop, I'm getting... Uh, Getting beeps on my phone there, sorry about that. Good shot by Wolfpack. He has got lucky. I could have gone wrong, but he's fine. Does seem to take a little bit too long for me. I'd like to see him speed his play up a little bit. You know, even just to he should have really left himself just a bit further to the right so he could just stun across. I think he still can, he'll have to hit it harder. Yeah, just causes you a little bit more work. But he's took these out well. 
and it's now 5-5 five, five, so an evenly poised match moves into its middle phase so the next three racks here very very interesting So it's a, a dry break from Wolfpack. If you'll excuse me, I'm just gonna go and get a refill and uh, pay a visit. So he's pushing out, so he wants to leave Sorgi a tough shot that he gives him back. We'll see what he leaves. Back in a second. So Wolfpack's in a bad snooker here. What's he gonna do? There's not really any way he can get to this, this uh, yellow. He might play a deliberate foul. Yeah, he has, he's played a deliberate foul. If I was Sogi, all I'd do here is knock the one across and leave the white tight behind the nine. Just leave him pretty much in exactly the same place. That's what he's gonna do. Can he control the white ball though? No cushion, that's a foul. So yeah, had to just be careful there to get a must had to get that white. So Wolfpack's got a good chance here to extend his lead. Just has to navigate the rock around a little bit. And I like these types of runouts, you know, because it, it just it requires a little bit of thought, but if you, as long as you and it tests your white ball control and that's not going to be good you know he won't be happy with that at all played that one well now can he cut this one in I think he can well if he can't then the break's over really the run's over but I think you've got to have a go at this. Oh, what a nice shot he's played there. Now he's just thinking, hell, get out from behind that black. Get out from behind that black. Well done, Wolfpack. He's still going. Pivot will run out this. If he can get this one, it would really be a dagger to Sogi's heart big time. Is he behind the black? Is he behind the black? Oof, I think he's going to have to jump at it again. Pretty careless at twice he's having to do this, but he's good enough to to get out of it, Wolfpack, but he shouldn't have really been near it, really. Got to look at when it's a natural angle. But when you can jump like that, who cares? So twice he's rescued himself at 5-5. Five, five. Got to take your hat off to him. And the big shot of the of the run so far. The black lines it up. Down she goes. So he hasn't he played it. He thought more about the pot than the position, which is totally fine. And a brilliant run out. Well done, Wolfpack. 6-5. Probably the best run out of the match so far. And couldn't have timed it better, could he? 11 to rack at 5-5. And if you could break and run here, what a great time that would be to get us to run out on the board. And there is going to be a shot on it. He's got a chance. 
good time in Wolfpack. Go moving up the gears. And that was a beautiful positional shot there, just holding the white beautifully. Gives him a real chance. You would think the only potential problem here is the green six to the black eight. Unless he, of course, self-inflicts one like he's done there. But I think he can just go around the back of the nine and the eight without any real issue. Just go take some time on the pot. And he'll be on the five. Got to watch Ian off in the top left-hand corner. And he seems to have a bottom on it, so we'll have to watch that as well. Yeah, that was that was an odd one. That um, he's creating problems for himself here, but he's okay. The problem he's got now is he kind of get perfectly on the six to get back on the eight, so he's going to have to rely. Oh, and how bad timing's that! He just saw in that rack, he just gradually made life more difficult for himself, and then capitulated. Zeke Karyuk has very nicely said, "Unlucky, nice try," but. I I think you've got to be a bit more critical there and say that he just gradually lost it in that run out. He says this race to nine is too long. Well, maybe. But Sorgi has missed a ball in hand shot and that is just unacceptable, I'm afraid. You just simply can't do that. Now, is Wolfpack getting tired? That's the one thing about me. If I was in this final, I'd just chug along. He's played a great shot there on the six. And has the is resistance fading now for Sorgi? Has he just had enough? Has he decided that the final was a good run? He kind of beat the lad. Wolfpack now 7-1 if you take into the handicap. And could now start to run away with it. We'll have to wait and see. But you'd think Sorgi has to win the next rack now. Um, otherwise it's going to be game over in pretty short order all of the VP guys are urging Wolfpack on because I think they don't want Sogi to win it on a four handicap but the handicap's the handicap you've got to, you've just got to beat them and a mistake from Wolfpack but he gets away with it again Nice to see Sorgi still trying though. Try to play safety. Didn't quite get there, but you now if I was Wolfpack, I'd probably be having a go at this middle pocket shot because he'd be on the two if he get it. He's got it, and he's on the two. So he might be moaning in the chat that it's too long, but he's he's still shooting the balls pretty well. Now I would go, he's enough again, Ooh. now was that the last little bit of luck that Zorgi could have had to get back in this game? Great shot from Wolfpack, he's really in stroke now. Controlling the white nicely, and that could be the shot that there's nothing else really that can go wrong in this rack unless he does something really silly. But this is like, you know, you're talking about championship players. A championship player will never lose a chance like this to go 8 5 up and throw it away to 7 6. It just doesn't happen. So let's see what Wolfpack does here. I can't see a problem. The only thing you could do would be to overthink the 8 ball and do something stupid. But at the same time, I think he'll be okay. Now, that one he hasn't hit very hard, but he's all right. It's a slightly tougher cut than he would have wanted, but, you know, it should be okay. Yeah, he's played that one really well, just nice and solid, banged it in, didn't get over silly about it, and again, just needs to punch this in. That's a nicely played. The cut won't bother him. I don't think he'll go in off here. 
just got to take your time, just a couple of couple of seconds more than maybe you normally would, just to be sure. And there she goes, nice shot. So, Wolfpack goes to the hill in this Friday night with nine ball tournament on January the sixteenth, twenty fifteen. With his uh, it's alternate break, so he's going to get a couple of chances to to win. Be nice to see Soggy get one. Uh, Vigeran's left. I think he's decided the game's over. Certainly not over yet, but Zogi's really sh uh, shown really shown nothing to suggest that he would make a really competitive match of it. Seems that he's just run out of steam at the end of this tournament. Well well played for him. He beat Stubb 7-0. And there's not many players can say that have done that. But that was maybe his moment in this tournament. And maybe the rest of it's for Wolfpack to win very good player by the way I've played him many times on the channel as you'll have seen and he knows where the, the table is but come on Sorgi let's see what you've got let's see you react a little bit no it's just not happening for him unfortunately in that three well it's not on it there's no combo maybe not but I'd rather be tempted just to wallop this site with a trying to snick it along. Just absolutely hammer it in, into the cushion right next to the nine and see what happens. Yeah, he might be going for this, you know. I think he's hitting it a bit too thin, but. Well, that's a sensible shot. And well played for both Pack for coming up with that shot. That's a really, really good shot. Nice white and keeping it solid. Not wanting to give him an inch. Good tournament pool. Could have easily got carried away there and tried to smash the nine ball in, but he's just played the percentage shot, just waiting for his chance. And unfortunately for Sogi, he's given them a chance a lot of the time, so he just has to wait. And uh, real Paul and Power, I think, has decided that uh, he's seen enough, and that's un unfortunate for for Sogi. But I think what he's done here, he's given Wolfpack his first real chance to clear up and to win. But of course, he's uh, made a bit of a mess the first chance. But he's a good jumper, as we've seen. I would expect him to jump this in. He really knows what he's doing with the jump stick. Uh, he's a really good jumper. Now, what that white needs to slow down. And put Stubbs just pop back in just to have a look. You feel Wolf packs just one good shot away from this tournament. I would cut this in the middle if you can. I don't know if you can make it. That's not in though. So gives away the first real opportunity. He's not giving away many opportunities, but that's definitely one of them. And uh, free balls just pop back in. I think word's gone round in the lobby that the match could be coming to an end. So I wouldn't begrudge Sogi a little comeback here. Be nice to see him put a couple of balls, you know, make Wolfpack earn it. Don't just throw it away and screw it up. That's a good shot there on the seven. Just has to roll this black in now and pot the easy nine and, and get back to the table. Always the hardest rack to win the ninth when the race to nine, or the second in a race to two, or the third in a race to three. So it's eight six now, and so he gets the break. Wolf packs two up with three to play. Just needs one more, and it's all over. So 
Soggy with a good break and a good chance to clear up you'd, you'd think in fact a great chance it would be really cool here to see a, a breaking dish 8-7 Wolfpack would a little seed of doubt would creep in. I think at the minute you'll be feeling quite comfortable. Probably a little, little bit uneasy here to do with, with the balls breaking as nicely as they did. But he will get the break in rack number 16 if Zogi does get to clear these up. I think if he doesn't, Wolfpack will win the tournament right here. But this is at the table. And he's got a chance. That's a good shot he's played there. The only slipping point here I think I can see is between the is the pot on the six to get on the eight really I think that's the only the only issue no he's playing it with topspin here I think this is an error you've got to screw this one back you can't play topspin yeah you're leaving yourself too much of a problem that's a good shot you just couldn't play topspin there I'm not quite sure what he was thinking but he obviously it, it became obvious now here you just play either stun it across or you play Lots of hard top spin. I'm not even sure you just stun it across really for me. But let's see what he does. Don't go in off, that's the main thing. Yeah, he played that one really well. Well done. So now it's just a, a simple roll in shot. And then easy nine ball. Now he took those out really well, so hats off to Sorgi. For making a game of break and dish, cannot argue with that when the chips are down. Had to had to react and he did. So we're now seeing a very interesting finish now. Pressure on Wolfpack here. And there goes a the ball. Has he got a shot on the one? He has. And the seven does go. So a break and dish for Wolfpack here. And it gets him the title. It's there. How's your, how's your nerves? The second really good chance that Wolfpack's had to knock this tournament on the head. Second time he's had one of those. He would have been suffering horribly there if that had gone in off. Or might have gone all the way. Wasn't looking likely at 8 4, 8 5. Hanging on by the skin of his teeth here, Wolfpack. Again, just one good shot away. Bounce, he says. Now we should be okay here if he just rolls this in with a little touch of right hand side. He'll check the white. That looks perfect. The best chance you'll get now to win. Didn't go far enough on that shot for me, but he still should be okay. And now Wolfpack looks at the final nine to win 9-7 and to win the tournament. Here's Wolfpack with the final nine. And there she goes, the, one, uh, the cue ball's fine. Wolfpack wins. Well done to Wolfpack, he is the winner of the tournament. Commiserations to Sogi. Thank you guys for watching the video. Check out Nineball.com's virtual pool videos as well. He does lots of good commentaries. Um, well done to Wolfpack once again. Check out Renault.tv and Virtual Pool for a blog. Get subscribed guys. And thanks for watching. Have a great night. I enjoy your weekend.